These are some Dinar Guru updates, starting off with Walking Stick. Uh, this is from Walking Stick's Iraqi Bank Partner Front Update. All the private banks in the CBI are meeting right now. The number one thing we are discussing is the money laundering. Most of this has been dealt with. We're constantly talking about the new small category notes, where to store them, how to issue them, and we're in conversation about the exchange rate we are about to release. Also, we meet with the CBI to talk about the international float, the currency exchange process. Mark Xavier PDK questioned the Kurdistan region proves its share of next year's budget. How much? Uh, Mark Z says 14% of the budget is going to Kurdistan. This is huge. This is the first time since we've been watching this that they have agreed to the HCL 140. We were told this was key before they announced the rate according to my contacts over there. CBI has been waiting for this. I was told in print they have agreed to the oil and gas law. All money will get shared as it is supposed to get shared. All right, Claire article quote Central Bank of Euphrates News. No denomination will be withdrawn from the currency and the 20,000 is in the process of being designed. Quote, it is noteworthy that Iraq has so far seven categories of local currency issued by the Central Bank of Iraq, which are 250 dinars, 500 dinars, 1,000 dinars, 5,000, 10,000, 25,000, and 50,000 dinars. Frank 26, Firefly Report, bank friend at the bank, thinks if Iraq gets this budget approved in December, that no doubt you will see a rate change in January. He's saying it's just his opinion. Frank says, yes, the budget draft law will open the reforms. And the guest guru, BD Dub, this is a follow-up to Frank uh, Wells Fargo Bank Post, um, says, I just called Wells Fargo Foreign Exchange on Thursday, December 1st. 2022 when i was called when i called last night i called apparently after business hours at 7:45 p.m. eastern standard time i asked if i had the foreign exchange people and she said yes i told her i had some foreign currency which i might like to exchange for us dollars she asked which currency i told her the iraqi dinar she explicitly said no i'm sorry we don't handle the iraqi dinar we don't exchange that particular currency so there you have it. I got the exact same message from a live person as I had received last night from a recorded message. Mark Zivia PDK, it's exceptionally quiet right now on the RV front, even out of Iraq. Mark Z says there is nothing negative. Everyone is still very upbeat. It could be any time. We do not know the timing. Militiaman uh, saying we saw meetings with the International Monetary Fund, the IMF, Central Bank of Iraq, CBI, Finance, Ministry of Iraq, the FM, the Federal Audit Bureau, the FAB, etc. They have the 2003 budget in the news today, too. That meeting with the IMF had auditors at the federal level. Then we see them talk about the budget draft to be voted on in the late hours prior to December 8, 2022 with the Parliament. The data necessary for a rate change is likely upon us sooner than later. Frank 26, article, quote, Parliament announces the agenda for next Saturday's session, completion of the ministerial cabinet, a government, a government by next Saturday, then the budget and all the lines revealed. Pimpy says, every time I read the news, it's not like I'm standing around clapping, going, oh, good, I got to wait even longer to see any kind of real change in the exchange rate. It's to the point now where I cannot picture them, Iraq, moving forward with the same currency knowing that there's much out there in the hands of some corrupt people. Maybe the international community won't care. I doubt it. Most likely what's going to happen, they're going to have to issue new currencies, making the stolen currencies obsolete. Bruce Fia Weiser now, I told you guys I wasn't calling it, but in my spirit, in my heart, I really thought we were done. That was it. Now certain things have happened. We have almost 1,300 bankers listed in less than 20 to 29 hours in Canada, the U.S., Iran, Iraq, Afghanistan arrested, probably needed to be done, probably needed that to happen before we went, and there may be more things that need to happen that still haven't happened. Caperoni says Parliament will complete the cabinet this week, and then they can RV the dinar. Not going to happen. Caperoni says this is not how monetary policy works. Frank 
26 article, quote, Al Sali announces the date of raising the budget to the House of Representatives and voting on it, unquote. Frank says they say budget by Tuesday. They missed the fifth by one day. And lastly, Bruce Weiser. Now it appears that those of us in Tier 4B will receive our notifications. At this point, it looks more like overnight Sunday into Monday morning. Set an appointment on Monday or changes to start on Tuesday. Now that's where it is right now. Looking very good at this point. Let's see what happens. Might not be anything until Monday, but you never know. They could surprise us and bring something on Saturday.